Hello and welcome back to Cosme Media. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can connect your Firebase and uh, Android Studio without downloading any. All events will be done inside the Android Studio. So go to this and tools and select Firebase like that. After loading is over, the Firebase tools will be and uh, move to the top. Yeah, we'll find analytics like that. Authentication and uh, real time database. Here in the authentication, you can authenticate with Google or Facebook and other authentication. The real time database you will find just get started. You can use any of these to connect, but I'm going to use the real time database and just click here connect to Firebase like that. It will launch the default browser. I'm using the default as Firefox. Wait for it to load after loading it will take you to this page and here you can select your project i have already created some projects here and so if you don't have any project you can click on create project it is an easy process i'm not going to dive into it i'm going to select one of the projects here and uh, as you can see that the loading is continuing and you can see that my android studio and fire firebase have been connected and it is indicated here just add the dependencies or do it it to sync it will take some moment but not too long let us see remember to be patient it might take some minutes or might take some few seconds these are dependencies they can take a lot of time or just a little time i'm going to add uh, another dependencies for the authentication by google it will download the required dependencies like that and after some time as you can see that it, have, it is downloading a lot of dependencies after some times it will complete a successful i'm also going to add some dependencies for the crowd firestorm just accept it is it might take a lot of time remember to be patient uh, so we can open gradle and uh, in the imp um, implementation you can see that there are fire base database fire base authentication and fire base fire store implemented and you can see that the sync is continuing as required it is going to take some few seconds or some few minutes it depending it depends usually depends on your internet connectivity on the machine brand and lam so thank you for watching next video i'm going to show you how you can send or you can set the firebase authentication codes and allow the firebase to authenticate your users and store their information and encrypt their passwords so keep in touch subscribe for more like this video and share to your friends till next time the part two firebase authentication part three firebase lead time database thank you for watching bye